<laughs> hey, did you guys see the news? What, the Rourke thing? Apparently, you two caused $3 million worth of damage. The guy literally lives in a glass house. Oh, yeah! You're gonna love this. Bam! What is that? What Dawes is keeping his dirty money? Your little tracker scheme worked? Now, right here, this is where Kai's phone wound up. Dawes' is corporate HQ. I mean, the place is a beast. We're talking private elevators, blast-resistant windows. Wait, I know that building. That's right on Foster Key off mainland Miami. And this is a work order for a vault that was installed in the penthouse suite six months ago. Okay, tell me about it. Foot-thick steel door with a combination lock and magnetic seal. So we blow it open? Ah, uh, the amount of explosives needed would level the building. So we don't blow it open, or do we? Now, I used to hang with some folks that have an auto-dialer. It's like a safe-cracking robot. They called it the Brute. I mean, the thing is fast, man. It can power open any combination safe. Call him. Tell him we need to borrow it. I already did. We just need to pick it up. Yay. Ooh. Graphics look awesome. Long way to come for a safe cracker. You really used to live out here? Oh, yeah. I was a little screwy after the army, you know, made a local friend, so I hung around for a while. Don't ask, don't tell, huh? Oh, that's funny. What'd you do in the army? Intelligence analyst. But no skills to work, I see. <laughs> Look, you try getting a straight job with a dishonorable discharge on your record during a recession. It's a long story, man. I went AWOL. For how long? Technically, I'm still AWOL. <laughs> so what about you, man? What's your story? Oh, Marcus! Dude! Oh. You got a little fat. What? You got a little looking good. <laughs> I'm gross. If I wasn't covered in dust, I'd be like SPF 5800 out here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I'm sorry. This is uh, uh, the friend I was telling you about. Hi, I'm Nick. Hello there, Mr. Nick. <laughs> oh, you look great. You really do. Thank you. So do you have the safe cracker thing or not? No, no, we have to go to the compound to pick it up. Oh, the compound. I, I thought you, you were gonna, um... Is your dad gonna be there? Oh my God, he's not mad at you anymore. Really? I mean, he's not gonna pop the champagne when he sees you, but... <laughs> so I guess we're gonna go pick it up then. Slightly awkward. <laughs> hey, you guys mind driving? Sure, why not? Awesome. Go to the right here, Nick. So oh yes, I must drive on this here? side of the road. Same old. Local or offshore? Mostly offshore. Where am I going? Follow the road, I'll tell you when to turn. So are you like enjoying the work? I'm enjoying the money. So what do you do, Nick? I work with Boomer. Oh, a boy's up to no good. So exciting. <laughs> so how's your dad? Is he still carrying that fucking gun? Marcus. <laughs> the world is not your own personal diorama. He's over it. All right, I gotta know what happened with you two. Well, we could. Marcus and I were very much in love. <laughs> My father did. <laughs> oh, I can give you one guess why. So when Marcus left the community, he tried to... Leave with you. ...kidnap me, my dad said, <laughs> which was so fucking romantic. But which kind of upset my dad, I guess? Show him your bracelet. Oh. GPS. So he always knows where I am. <laughs> Great. Yeah. <sighs> like a Walter White caravan on the uh, on the left hand side, Breaking Bad style. <laughs> oh, it's not a drivable one. That would be so cool. Oh, is it a drivable one? Nah, it's not. So your dad sounds intense. He was in SEAL Team 6. Oh, he was not in SEAL and Team 6. due to problems with the socialist tyranny of the American government, he founded a community of like-minded patriots. Patriots? Are guys here armed? Totally armed. So Nick, it's cool. I know these people. They're mostly hippies. Actually, all the hippies you knew are gone. What? Where'd they go? Just gone. Haha. <laughs> Dirt road straight ahead, that's ours. That audio cue was a bit late. Could have been 
moved a little bit earlier. Spoon, the prodigal, etc. <laughs> hey, Mr. Albert, thanks for seeing us. Oh, it's the least I can do. And you must be Nick. Boomer says you got a machine that can brute force any combination lock. Well, certainly can, Nick. You just gotta give it a little time. Nick Mendoza, right? Oh, hey, look at that. Shit just got real. <laughs> kind of monitors my calls. Yeah, a lot of people want to talk to you, Mendoza. Including a fella from L.A. named Stoddard. Say he'd pay 250 grand for you alive. He's coming wow. here right now. Sorry, Marcus. Boys, what do you say we escort Mr. Mendoza and Marcus down to the presidential suite? Wait, you said just Nick. <laughs> Marcus isn't welcome here. He never was. Oh, baby, I'm so sorry. <sighs> Peel her off this asshole before I puke. Oh, and Marcus, just so we're clear, race is not a factor here. My dislike of you is strictly personal. <laughs> that does not look comfy. Really? <laughs> Where'd you get that? Doom gave it to me when she hugged me. Doom? Who just set us up? Doom? Who set you up? She's, uh... She's actually really good people. <laughs> oh, sure. Dialogue in this campaign is, is really, really nice. I mean, some of the cues that right. could be a little bit earlier or a little bit later. But overall, conversation is really nice. We gotta find a way out of here. Ain't no argument here. What the hell is this place anyway? A missile silo, decommissioned in the early 90s. Dude used to party down here. Uh, please tell me Alfred doesn't have a nuke. I don't have a nuke. Gotta know. <laughs> <laughs> This way. Come on, let's find that escape hatch. This is quite eerie down here. That Marcus kid, anyway. The fucking know it all. Can't believe you got to let scumbags like that live around here. Shit. We had them, Mexicans, hippies, some fucking Marcus.
His kid anyway. Little fucking know-it-all. Can't believe you guys used to let scumbags like that live around here. Shit, we had them, Mexicans, hippies, some fucking dude. <laughs> Oh dear. Hey there. Doing something down here. Right, let's keep moving. What is this? Hey, one of these idiots had my scanner. Hey, there's a ladder. That's our way out. Yeah. Come on. Yay, we did it. Right. All right. We need to get our gear back. What? Are you nuts? Let's just get out of here. Look, if Stoddard gets his hands on it, he'll trace it right back to Kai and Tyson. Okay, we can't risk that. Shit. All right, so how you want to take this, man? There's a lot of Alpert's dudes down there. Uh, looks like there's a place to climb in on the left. Okay, or we could crawl under that fence over there on the right. Yeah, or we could take them head on. What? If you're up for that. Man, you lead. I'll be right behind you. That's what I thought. Okay. Nick. Okay, let's get this a guy. There's the alarm hey, box. Sweet ass. Wow, there's loads of them here. Like Mac 10, that'll do. Look, I'm gonna try to reach Doom. Shit, don't you have any other friends? Not out here. Hold it right there. Yeah. Oh shit. Whoa. <sighs> Okay. Come on. What the fuck? Where'd that come from? Freeze. Stay right where you are. Alright, brother, you just take it nice and easy there. Alright? Hey, hey, hey! Ah! Get him! Hey, look down! So much destruction. Burn him out. Oh. Get back. Holy crap. Burn him up. Over there. Oh my god, there's like five of them. They're all grouped together. supposed to do? I've forgotten. I'm really sorry I can't open my scanner right now. Ah! I'm stuck! Oh, 
that? <laughs> I think I've escaped. Without hardly any firefight. Yay. Guys, right here, get in. Come on, quick, get in the car. I don't need to do that, I just need to get in. <laughs> Go. Hey, you want to talk about what's going on here? It's like these guys are geared up for their own private apocalypse. Yeah, Tony's kind of flipped his lid. Ha <laughs> think? What do you guys even need a safe cracking robot for anyway? Uh, to steal something? Well, at least it's being used for a noble cause. Head for the airstrip. That's where your brood is. Okay, you know, sure it's there. Yes, I'm sure. That's where Tony keeps all his crap. Just drive. Okay, look. There's one thing I want to know. Oh, just one? Hey, well, there's hey. a lot of things I'd like to Could know. Could you just hang on? Dooney, why did you <laughs> your dad lure us into a trap? I assumed Nick was just one of your dirtbag friends until they found out he's a cop, which is kind of worse, but whatever. Whatever? Whatever? You know you're coming with us now, right? Oh, really? Jesus! Oh, oh shit. Boomer! What if instead I turn you both over to this Stoddard person and collect my 250 grand? What the hell, woman? <laughs> I'm totally messing with you guys. God, we're crazy. This gun's not even loaded. <sighs> shit. Well, that one is. <laughs> Whoa. That was big. Is everyone okay? Dude's been hit! That shot in the arm. Yeah, my leg's broken. Oh, we gotta get you some help. Marcus, those guys that ambushed us, they're coming. You remember this thing? Right. Nick. Hold him off while I do some triage. There's guns in the trunk. You got it. Now, for the record, this place has changed a lot. Oh, here we go. God. Oh my God, Jesus Christ. Still coming, are they? Shotgun's probably not the best thing to be using right now, but it's pretty much all I've got, so. Hey, over this way! Fuck 
That was close. That's all of them. Thank God. Hey, you okay? I need you to do me a favor. Tony's a hunter, so I could use a diversion. I've decided I kind of hate the desert. <laughs> so you're not coming with us. We can get you to a hospital. Nah, you seem kind of busy. <laughs> Airfield's that way, you better hurry. Hey, Tony. Oh, yeah. Good luck. See you around? <laughs> Whoa. She's crazy. And tell Tony I think he's a wang. <laughs> We got another car or something we can use. Um, oh, is it in here? Oh, we're using the June buggy. Oh yeah. Hey, you wanna check out that burnt out house before we go? The fire looks kinda recent. I told you dudes good people. Her dad's gonna come after us with everything he's got, you know. Not if we leave first. It's an airfield, right? Maybe we'll find a plane. So, uh, what did Dune mean when she said Tony keeps all his crap at this airstrip? Tony's always kind of collecting shit. The less legal, the better. Really? So what are we talking about here? Military black market shit. Tanks, choppers. He's even got a couple of grounded planes. Tony's got a lot of money, man. Drug stuff. Plus, he's real literal about his Second Amendment rights. Yo, that's it. The old airfield. Keep going. Airfield's just ahead. Long drive, this. You know, I find it hard to believe you were a cop. Yeah. Well, my dad was a cop, too. For real? Not the kind you're thinking of. You know the SDE? Cuban secret police? Oh, okay, wait, what? Well, so what? You, you followed in his footsteps? Hey, you tell me, man. His job was torturing prisoners. And he liked to bring his work home, you know what I mean? That's why I became a cop. A real cop. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry that didn't work out. Well, it turns out you don't have to be a cop to stop people like him. Time to walk. Come on. Hello. Woo. Oh yeah, she's pretty and banged up, but I can fix it. Yeah, I'm not sure I want to fly a broken plane you fixed. What? No offense. Man, what are you trying to say, man? Are you doubting Boomer? Man, get out of here. I can fix this. I'll go find the brute. Radio's on, all right? Uh huh. Uh huh. Radio's on. Boomer, Tony's guys are already here. Uh, 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 do you see like a, uh, uh, a warehouse across the way? Yeah, yeah, it's barricaded. You can't sneak in? Oh, hang on. Hey, I think I got an idea. It might be a little loud.
Oh, this is so cool. So sweet, man. <laughs> okay, that was so cool. Best part of the campaign so far. No doubt that. No doubt. <laughs> Boomer. I got the brute. Sweet. Oh, shit. Crap. What the hell is that? Someone just shell this fucking building. Just fix that goddamn plane. I'll hold them off. Oh no, I'm in a tank. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Whoa! For those of you saying that there aren't tanks in Battlefield Hardline, well, here's your evidence right here. More choppers! What do you expect? You just started a war! Man, I'm just too good. Oh, is that all I got to do? Oh, yeah. Fuck it. This thing's ready to fly. Yeah, I'm on my way. And Boomer, fuck it is not encouraging. Oh, yeah. Nick, I'm rolling out into the... <laughs> Here we go. After we join up with Kai and Tyson, we are going straight to Miami. Yeah, told you I could fix it. <laughs> 